Welcome to Let's Talk Meshing Tutorial Tuesday, where we show you how to use a feature in just a couple of minutes. In this video, we demonstrate the Draw Curves command for defining new curves using a variety of segment options in PointWise. The Draw Curves command can be accessed from the Create menu, or alternatively from the Curve drop-down toolbar shortcut. A new panel opens where users can select from several segment type options. In this tutorial video, we're going to limit our focus to the first two of these segment types, namely line and curve segments. Within the Draw Curve panel, I can choose to create connector or database entities from within the entity type frame. Drawing either line or curve segments pointwise proceeds in a similar manner. You first insert control points that are used to define either the line or curve segment. These control points can be inserted using either the available XYZ entry field, display window, or various offset values in the advanced frame. Once a few control points have been added, you can delete the last control point using the delete button or remove all of the interior control points using the delete all interior button. You can edit the placement of these control points by hovering your cursor over the point within the display window until the point is highlighted. Left click and drag the point to its new location. The Restore button allows you to undo the last change made to a control point and return it to its original position. Within the Advanced frame, there is a pull-down menu that provides several options to constrain the movement of control points to a specific plane depending on how your view within the display window is oriented. These options often come in handy when editing the placement of control points in the display window. Each connector or database curve can consist of multiple segments. Use control points to define segments, and then add, insert, or delete segments using the corresponding buttons within the segments frame. Curve segments are cubic polynomials between successive points. Their slope is defined either by Katmo, Ram, Akima, or Bezier control algorithm. You can select which slope control is used using the corresponding radio buttons in the curve segment options frame. A Katmo ROM slope at a given point is parallel to a chord between the two adjacent points. At the end of a curve, the slope will be tangent to the end point and the adjacent point. An Akima slope at a given point uses a stencil of five consecutive points, three of which will share a linear slope, and produces curves with fewer wiggles or overshoot. The Bezier option allows slope control at each control point. Finally, click OK or Apply to save your curve. And that is an overview of how to use the Draw Curves command in PointWise. Thank you and have a pleasant Tuesday.